Hi, and welcome to my presentation. I'm John Marsiglio, and my abstract is on mentorship initiatives in radiation oncology, a systematic review of the literature. So mentorship has been well documented as an effective tool for career develop development. Um, we define mentorship as a reciprocal relationship between an advanced incumbent and a beginner aimed at the development of both. This describes the classic dyad form of mentorship, one mentor, one mentee. And radiation oncology is a small field where learning is often self-directed, and this can create difficulty identifying and fostering mentorship relationships. Given these challenges, there is value to understanding the state of mentorship in radiation oncology. So our methods, so we define a search protocol according to the preferred reporting items for systematic reviews. And our inclusion criteria included the following. The articles must meet the definition of mentorship, describe a mentorship initiative related to career development, not just a particular skill, and it must be specific to radiation oncology. So our search came up with around 1,400 unique results, which we independently reviewed and determined article eligibility. And then we went through in press articles and the references of the included articles to reach a final total of 12 publications that met the inclusion criteria. Our results, so the majority of articles featured the dyad as their type of mentorship, less commonly there was a team mentorship that's with many mentors mentoring one mentee. And the mentored participants were most commonly residents, followed by med students, followed by attendings. Initiatives are most commonly evaluated through surveys and less commonly evaluated by tracking mentee productivity metrics and less commonly by interviewing mentees. And outcomes were mostly subjective, such as uh, resident satisfaction or resident, uh, resident uh, confidence with career development. And less commonly, outcomes were evaluated with objective metrics, such as number of publications or author age indice. So few initiatives were reported in the literature, but the identified studies suggest that they are successful in promoting career development and increasing professional satisfaction. Overwhelmingly, the literature described mentorship dyads, so that means other forms are either less common or understudied. And most were not evaluated in a controlled setting. Many were assessed by survey with low response rate which raised some concern for selection bias in these studies. So this review highlights rich opportunities for future scholarship to develop, evaluate, and disseminate radiation oncology mentorship initiatives, particularly with consideration of multi-institutional efforts. And thank you for attending my virtual presentation. Please reach out to me at the email address below if you have any questions or comments. And I'd like to thank all my co-authors and uh, a special thank you to David Rosenberg, Michael Rooney, and Dr. Golden for their support and mentorship.